And I write about that at length. I was going to say, book. Jeff, we must talk about the book because you know, yeah. all the years I've known you, I've, I've watched you grow, and all the blogs that you started writing about the things you were grateful for, mm -hmm. and this all led you to a place now where you are a qualified life coach, mm -hmm. and, and you now help other people. Um, yeah, it's amazing what you do. Um, and you've, you've written this, the grief survival guide, how to navigate loss and all that comes with it, um, and it is. A survival, isn't it? You sure. have to survive. I have to make it really clear, by the way, to anyone sort of looking at this, but that it's not my memoirs. This is not 100% no. about myself, the kids, and about Jay. In fact, it's probably about 10, 15% mm. at the very most. As a life coach, I've met so many clients that are bereaved because they naturally probably look at me and think, Jeff, you're living it, so maybe you're the best person for me to speak mm. to. Um, I don't ever tell them what they should do. Coaching is, is where I help them find the answers for themselves. Um, so they come in with their problem, and through the coaching journey, whether it's hours, whether it's, you know, longer than that. Um, I see that, I get the benefit of that education. They, they, they find solutions themselves. Mm -hmm. And as a result of it, I end up with so much that it just seemed very wasteful for me to not compile it in a book and put it out Well, listen, there. it's great that you want to help people. You, you have done an amazing job with those boys. You must be so proud. And Jay should be proud. Um, they really are delightful boys. And, you know, we're all thinking about her today. It was her birthday yesterday. And I know it's been hard for you to talk about her, but it, it's been nice for us to remember. Yeah, anyone bereaved will seriously benefit yeah. from reading. The Grief Survival Guide, Jeff mm -hmm. Brazier. Thank you very Thank much. You.